What is up everybody, Graham from the Recording Revolution here, haha <laughs> just joking, it is your boy Fry, hope you're doing well, shout out to Graham though, in today's video I really want to show you a plugin which is just such an underdog of a VST, it is the Waves MV2, we'll get into it just in a second, but yeah man, it's a really nice plugin, definitely make sure to smash like and subscribe man to the notification squad, I'll check you out in the comments, but yeah, Waves MV2, really cool plugin, we can quickly just look at the layout of it, it is just three faders, so pretty cool, easy to use, and it has a low level section, high level section, and then an output trim. And really what we want to be concentrating on is the low level section. And it's basically a low level compressor. It's something that actually lifts all of the lowest parts of your signal uh, and then makes them louder. So that's the kind of magic of it. If you want to kind of see a graph of it, we can just put up the waves manual. Uh, definitely always put up the waves manuals. You can learn a lot about these plugins. So we go to the low level section right here and you can basically see if we zoom in that it is going to compress everything below the threshold. So I guess uh, I'm not really one to look at these graphs too much, but basically you can make low levels louder. And you know, why would that be relevant to you? Well, it is pretty cool when you use it on a vocal group, as you'll see now, uh, you can just see how much detail it brings out of your vocal bus. It kind of lifts up the background vocals. So it's really cool. Uh, you can use it on a two track instrumental as well. If you know, you've been given a song to mix and you don't have the stems, you could definitely make use of it and pull up maybe for example, the background synths or maybe the hi-hats a bit too low you could try this out and it just does something cool so we'll take a listen to this track this is a, a track that i mixed quite a while ago i was going through some plugins and i found this and thought it'd be cool to show you as an example so we'll take a listen to it definitely listen for the background vocals and then we'll turn it off and then back on and we'll a b and see the differences so let's get it i keep a cat these demons keep watching on me why they keep watching on me the racks in my jeans i might just pull up and fuck up the scene pull up and fuck up the scene Tony Hawk, watch out, keep an eye on it Keep a smile on her face, but I know she frontin' Switch plays, now I ain't runnin' Smokin' on plus, I'm way too blunted Way too late, don't wanna talk Alright, so there you go, pretty cool And yeah, we'll turn it off right now And then we'll just AP it afterwards So here's without the MV2 on I keep a cat, these demons keep watching on me Why they keep watching on me? The racks in my jeans, I might just pull up and fuck up the scene Pull up and fuck up the scene Tony Hawk, watch out, keep an eye on it Keep a smile on her face, but I know she frontin' So it's pretty nice, but it just lacks that kind of higher mid energy, that kind of extra detail surrounding the main vocal, obviously, because we've got our double ad libs and background stuff all going into the vocal bus. So yeah, man, we'll turn it on and off and then we can tell the difference. It's very subtle, obviously, because the settings I'm using are subtle. I will also enhance it so you can uh, tell the difference. Let's get it. I keep a cat, these demons keep watching on me. I keep a cat, these demons keep watching on me. Why they keep watching on me? I keep a cat, these demons keep watching on me. Why they keep watching on me? The racks in my jeans. It just kind of sounds like it, it it sounds like there's a little bit of eq being added uh we also have the high level section which i didn't speak about which is actually the it's similar to an rvox style compressor that's what the uh manual uh, relates to you know just one knob pull down things get louder that's kind of a waves uh, specialty you know the l1 limiter there's a few plugins that do that but really cool so it's really nice to be able to blend your low level signal and then your high level signal and you end up with a much more refined clean and clinical sound so what i'll do right now is i'll boost the low level so you can kind of hear what it sounds like i won't go too crazy because obviously it just starts to sound muddy but um i'll boost it up a few um, points upwards and we'll see what that sounds like i keep a cat these demons keep watching on me why they keep watching on me the racks in my jeans i might just pull up and fuck up the scene pull up and fuck up the scene tony her watch out keep an eye on it smile on her face but i know she frontin switch blade now i ain't running so it's really cool a lot of people ask me you know we can week out hey waves is on sale what plugins should i buy i definitely recommend you purchase this if you can't purchase any plugins definitely demo it test out and have some fun uh but there's another plugin you could also use the closest thing you'll get to this for free version would probably be the um w1 limiter where is my w1 limiter um hmm i don't know where my w1 is these days man we can probably go in here and find it w1 there you go and this is a free plugin and it's pretty cool it's going to give you a similar sound by compressing the threshold obviously it's but it's more like a, a l1 so you're not going to get the exact same sound but it's definitely something to try out if you cannot afford this but nonetheless you know really cool download compression i guess is the name of this technique uh but definitely try it on beats definitely try it on your vocal buses definitely try it on dialogue as well once in a while i'll use it on dialogue if i just quickly need a voiceover to get done wow smash it a little bit you get a very, very nice upfront vocal but anyway that was my mix 
tip for the day i guess man hopefully you enjoyed yourself hopefully you learned something um definitely try stuff out on your vocal groups if you feel your thing your vocals need a bit more detail uh, and i'll check it next time have a good day have a great weekend peace out